up until just a few minutes ago, things have been all dry here in Albany. Now we're starting to see some light shower activity pushing into the tri cities. In fact, Albany and Troy in particular. Here's a live look out in East Greenbush from our Adirondack Orthodontics camera here at 614. We're looking off towards the west where things have been a lot wetter as you've been working through the first part of your Monday morning. Here's a look at the radar. You can see generally some light rain from Gilderland towards Albany and Troy. Meanwhile, as we get up from about Amsterdam into the southwest corner of Saratoga County, getting closer to Boston Spa, rain really picks up in intensity and that is continuing to lift towards the north and east. So Spa City is about to get really wet once again. That will ultimately find its way towards Glens Falls, also into Washington County. Meanwhile, looking farther towards the west, Fort Plain getting hit with another downpour at this point. That's been working right along the throughway. Could see some gusty winds inside that batch of heavy rain. As we look to the south of Albany, coverage has been pretty sparse so far when it comes to showers. Ravina is seeing some shower activity. So is Coxsackie. Hudson, you're just through the rain right now. Meanwhile, some heavier rain tracking towards Valencia and also the town of Ghent. And eventually, I-90 is going to be getting a little bit wetter too there in Columbia County. All this rain coming in ahead of a cold front that is going to be an air mass changer. Of course, over the weekend, it was hot, started to get a little sticky yesterday with that heat too. Well, by this afternoon, humidity levels will start to drop. But first, we've got to push the rain out of here. It's still going to be wet during the morning commute. As the chores about 9, 10 a.m., most of the rain will be winding down. Still could see some stragglers in terms of some scattered shower activity through about the lunch hour. Then into the afternoon, welcome back sunshine, some lower humidity as well. It's going to feel so much better, especially by wake up tomorrow. In the meantime, right now we're dealing with some showers, downpours, even some rumbles of thunder. Humidity drops, skies will clear, and temperatures will climb only into the 70s this afternoon. Open up the windows while you sleep tonight. We're dropping to 55. Be a little breezy early on, but the wind will settle down by morning. Nice day as New Yorkers head to the polls tomorrow for primary day. Sunshine 77. We're back to the 80s on Wednesday. Warming trend carries us through the end of the week with a high near 90. We could see some showers and thunderstorms that may interrupt some 4th of July cookouts Saturday and uh, Saturday in particular. Things are looking better though for the remainder of the holiday weekend.